Hi friends, it's Suzanne from sunstampin.com. Welcome back to my paper pumpkin alternative catch-up series. I'm trying to get back on track with my paper pumpkin subscription. I want it to go from this to some beautiful masterpieces. I hope that I can offer you some gentle motivation to catch up yourselves if you're like me. And if you're not like me and you just like the design, why not create something similar with the supplies that you have in your stash? I'm headed to my sketchbook to try to create a design sketch for this box. Hello friends. So this box is called Fun in the Sun uh, and it's for July of 2023. And there's a whole bunch of components to this. It was supposed to make nine cards and envelopes. The coordinating colors was Azure Afternoon, a basic gray, crumb cake, daffodil delight, flirty de flamingo, uh, granny apple, green, melon mambo, and pool party. And... I'm sharing all the components, super fun. And it's supposed to be one of those step cards. I think I've done a step card before in some of my other videos. But so here's my sketchbook. You know how I like to start with the sketchbook. And with this series, I am sharing, you know, my complete thought process. So I'm looking at some of the components and these two pieces go together. And I'm thinking about that sailboat, maybe a little bit lower down on that um, and popped up. I'm thinking of a regular card, so not a stepped up card. I'm going to bring in basic white and I'm going to bring in that beautiful blue color. It's almost the same color as my car, the um, Azure Afternoon. My car is a little bit more candy colored. Anyway, I lop the top of this uh, scene off and then I, yeah, I like, I'm going to cut about an inch off like the boring uh, blue piece off the boat there. It's about an inch. And then I have a piece of basic white that I am going to cut to three and five eighths by three and five eighths. And then I'm going to adhere this card to, uh, with a little bit of a border. So uh, I'm, it's very, very little. So, and then, um, I'm going to put dimensional adhesive underneath the boat and adhere that. So this is my focal piece. So if I wanted to put this on a blue card, I would have to have, um, some, uh, I, well, <laughs> what I chose to do was put a mat on my card front so I can stamp the sediment straight on that mat uh, so that's basic white and that was I think four and an eighth by five and three eighths. I like a skinny border and then this one uh, this is azure afternoon three and three quarters by three and three quarters square. I pop that up on dimensionals put that to the top portion and then I didn't know what sentiment I was going to do and this is a little trick if you pull the sentiment off and you lay it on your page, just like I'm doing here, I'm able to see the length of it and if it would look good or not without having to do a practice trial about that. So I inked it up with Memento Tuxedo Black ink. The sentiment says, I see, S-E-A, brighter days ahead. And I'm using these little gemstones that came in the kit. So I have one more card to share with you. You can come back on Thursday to check that one out. But thank you so much for watching and subscribing and thumbs upping and all the YouTube-y things. I will see you next time. Bye for now.